Hello, I'm Rich Dean with West Coast Collector Cars in Oregon, and today I have a 1953 Ford F100 pickup to show you. Um, this this truck is finished in fire engine red, and that's that's actually the color, and it does look like fire engine red. Uh, it was finished about 11 years ago, the restoration, and the paint is a base coat, clear coat. It's very nice, shines very well, but it's a high-end driver quality paint. So what I'll do is take you around the truck and, and show you the truck. We'll start it, we'll uh, hear it run, I'll take it around the parking lot so you get a sense of, of how it operates. So at any rate, it is an F100, it's a 1953. All the chrome and bright work is very nice. It has dual mirrors, these are cool, these are original style mirrors and they're very nicely chromed. All the window felts in here are finished, done, brand new. Let me open up the door here. I'll show you as well. The weather stripping was uh, replaced when the truck was painted, so all of that is done. The interior is done in this two tone gray tweed. Notice the door handles and your cranks and everything. Our chrome is very nice. The carpet is nice. It's got these stainless trim pieces here. Uh, you can see it's a bench seat. Now, and also the headliner uh, is gray done in the same material as the door panels and the seat so it looks very nice in here it's very clean very well done glove box nice condition your gauges uh, over there are original and everything works uh, all the gauges work with the exception of the battery gauge it doesn't work let me show you in back here uh, point out to you that uh, the fuel tank has been removed from the back and is now under the truck, you know, so you got a little bit more room back here, which a lot of people like. Again, the weather stripping both sides here uh, completed. Uh, it's all brand new, you know, since the truck was painted. Doors shut nice. Shut lines are nice and even, as you can see. Uh, panels here are very nice, you know, your floorboards. Your welting here. This has all been replaced during the paint job. So that, that's kind of nice too. Take a look at the bed. Uh, this is an oak bed wood kit and it's got the stainless strips here. All of the uh, fasteners are chrome. Very nice condition. Uh, obviously the walls of the bed were painted black. You know, a person wanted to haul something, some furniture or something in here, this would be great, but I uh, probably wouldn't recommend hauling bark dust or rock in it. It's just it's too nice for that. Uh, old style original tail lights, the bumper, chrome, very nice too. It does have dual exhaust. Got a nice dual exhaust system with Flowmaster mufflers. Um, it sounds great, and we'll, we'll hear that here in a moment. Uh, here's the fuel filler, uh, the boot, and everything has been replaced. It's brand new too and uh, right in there to the fuel tank. Wheels and tires, uh, these are Ford steel wheels. You know they got the poverty caps here with Ford embossed and these are nice radial tires. They're all in excellent condition. Really look nice on the truck. The truck has a nice look to it. Front end was, uh, was uh, replaced with uh, a Plymouth Volari front end which was uh, common to do a few years back. It makes it nice to drive does have power steering, power front disc brakes, and that just makes for a, a nice driving truck. While we're here, let me just go ahead and open the hood for you. Find the hood latch. It has a double hood latch, which they did originally. Now this is a Ford 289 engine. Uh, it's got a little four barrel on it. It does have electronic ignition, Cobra valve uh, covers and air cleaner. Here's your power steering pump. The uh, power brake booster and master cylinder are under the truck, so that kind of cleans up this firewall area here. Chrome alternator over here. Uh, this is an original type of uh, radiator. This truck does not overheat. It starts, it runs, it drives very nicely. This is an excellent truck. The grill is in very nice condition, as you can see. You know, it's painted the same color as the truck. Looks very nice. This truck would actually be ideal 
uh, if you wanted it for your business, uh, you put your business logo uh, on the door, you know, on both doors, and, and just make it just a really cool business uh, truck, kind of like I did with my Chevy over there. You might be able to see that. This truck also has tilt steering column, and uh, the signals work, they cancel, Beep. horn works. Uh, what I'll do is I'll uh, go ahead and start the engine and uh, you'll be able to hear it run, you'll hear the exhaust. Uh, I'll just take it for a little spin around the parking lot here just so you get an idea that it does run and drive properly. Always starts nice, runs great, starts up cold in the morning, uh, you know, fast idles and everything like it should. It's a great, great little truck. Sounds great. I'll be right back. Again, everything works on the truck. Um, all the glass is very nice. Windows roll up and down nicely. Uh, it's got these nice visors in here. You probably saw those earlier. Uh, match the truck very well. Uh, the little heater motor works. Uh, it, it's just a fantastic truck. This is a truck you could drive anytime you want, anywhere you want. Uh, I can't imagine it giving you any problems. It's just very nice and tight. If you have any questions about this truck, don't hesitate to give me a call. Again, my name is Rich Dean. This is West Coast Collector Cars, 503-851-6763, and thank you for watching today.